Ventura. It's Ashley with your Crime and Safety Update from the Ventura Police Department. Congratulations to Corporal Dean Cole for being selected as the Crisis Intervention Team Officer of the Year, alongside Sheriff's Deputy Greg Lindsay. Crisis Intervention Team Officers respond to individuals in crisis as a result of a mental health disorder and help de-escalate the crisis in the most effective and compassionate manner possible. These officers receive special training on how to approach and speak to someone suffering from a mental health crisis. This training equips officers with tools to help the situation end peacefully. The Crisis Intervention Team program was implemented in Ventura County in 2001. Over 90% of Ventura police officers have completed CIT training. 81% of Ventura County law enforcement is CIT trained. The program works to develop partnerships with mental health service providers and law enforcement so that individuals can receive the care and treatment they need. Congratulations to Corporal Cole for being recognized with this award. My name is Officer Alston with the Ventura Police Department. In the past seven days in the city of Ventura, there were two residential burglaries, four vehicle burglaries, 18 thefts from unlocked vehicles, two package thefts, six reported crimes of tire slashes. Please report anything suspicious to the Ventura Police 24-hour non-emergency phone number at 805-650-8010. It's very important to remove valuables from your vehicles, lock all doors, and close all windows. Those 18 thefts from unlocked vehicles can often lead to other crimes like identity theft. So please protect yourself by securing your property. Thank you for your time. Have a great day. A big part of keeping our community safe is partnering with drivers. Let's take a look at our traffic safety tip of the week from our traffic unit. My name is Corporal Al Gomez. I'm a motor officer with the Ventura Police Department Traffic Unit. This week's traffic safety tip is to focus on the road while driving a motor vehicle. The Office of Traffic and Safety reports the second leading cause of traffic collisions are related to distracted driving. Reading a text message behind the wheel can take your eyes off the road for an average of five seconds. This is enough time to drive the length of a football field. Those five seconds can impact your life forever. Please keep the community safe by not being a distracted driver. Over the past week, there was an incident where a suspect was arrested for a lewd act on a child at a location frequented by families. This incident is a reminder to review child safety tips to help protect your child. KidSmarts.org is a resource created by the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. KidSmarts provides resources for families about how to talk to children about this topic. It's important that children understand they have a right to say no. Setting those boundaries around touch is an important part in keeping kids safe. Reminding children that their bodies are their own and that they need to tell a trusted adult if someone makes them uncomfortable. It sounds simple, but it's really important because there have been cases where children have not felt comfortable telling someone about activity and other cases of children not being believed by the adult they tell. Please visit kidsmarts.org for more information. We hope this information is helpful in keeping you and your loved ones safe. For more information, please call us at 805-339-4317. We will see you next week. Stay safe.